guys hello look i'm making a quick video and uh shout out to chad too uh fuck, i didn't ask him to use it. anyway he knows who he is so um i actually closed things down and watched a video lesson uh the one that tim recently put up but then i noticed um idxg uh diabetes play um there was some sort of you know news catalyst there nothing really substantial but something i thought would be significant enough and that actually pushed this past a dollar forty. You're gonna see some question marks, but that's fine. So it traded as high as dollar forty six, dollar forty seven. So I got in around here and I got out pretty quick at around dollar forty. So a <clears throat> hundred dollar loss. I bought uh it was two thousand shares, you know, some would say that's aggressive Scott. Um, 10, 10 grand account, but you know, I don't fuck around, that's how I do it. Um, I thought it was a high probability play. Um, you know, where are we? It's a daily chart. I closed quickly though. I closed quickly. So as you can see, it's up quite a bit on positive news, five minute chart. But you know, it'd been floating and contesting a dollar forty on the on the dollar chart, on the one minute chart, sorry. Just uh, watching the chat room, you know, and I put it up on the chat room as well with Tim Lentz. I just like to broadcast my failures and wins. So it was hundred dollar loss. Um, execution was good. You know, I saw it hit a dollar forty five, and then I waited. And I'll get up on Market Watch guys. So it's not great on my Interactive Brokers demo account, but I was I was happy with the execution. I didn't mess around. I I was waiting, and then once it, you know, bounced off a dollar. Um, 45 and I got executed. I tried a dollar 45, but it wouldn't get. So I it was playing around dollar 43, dollar 44. So I won dollar 44 because it was high dollar 43 and then executed. But I'll just show you um, and explain my thesis here of why. So we got an IDXG. Look, this wasn't on the watch list, but that's the beauty of you know, being in the chat room and it's still floating around dollar forty, which is a bit frustrating, you know. Very happy to get to um a dollar forty because it went down to a dollar thirty eight and I was actually I was gonna I was ready a dollar thirty eight. So I was ready with the the order there to be filled to sell it. Um I'll bring it across. Sorry guys. So I'll just bring the daily chart up. So we'll get rid of this. Um so I was watching it and I established, I was just discussing um, with uh, one of my trading buddies here in Western Australia and, you know, it was, it was teetering around and it had slow volume, um, you know, so I closed things down at around 10 o'clock and then it went up again and I got it around here, would have been around here and I held, went down again, dollar 38 and now it's just, you know, so I was happy. I waited. And it could just not get through a dollar forty. So I, I ended in the order for a dollar forty and I got filled straight away. So volume's not well, it's pretty shit, but um yeah. So and it looks like it's probably, yeah. it, it it might it might not come you know, to to be honest, I think the move has been made. And the markets are gone okay. So yeah, can a press release come? Who knows? I mean let's let's go back, let's see what's going on. I'm gonna have to sip my coffee. 11 o'clock at night drink coffee. Oh, it's the life of a trader. Um, okay. Yeah, here it is. So. So it was more of a um a pre market buy. All right, so it was a dollar dollar and eight. So there was a bit of pre market activity, and so it got up to yeah. So dollar forty five. So I bought it high, but I thought it was breaking out, and I missed it when it cleared a uh, dollar forty because that was strong resistance from around fourteen to June. Uh, you know, and it's just it's teasing. But with plays like this, if it you know, I was looking for it to really Take off to around dollar fifty. I was looking for ten cents a share, honestly. So if we crack over dollar fifty, I would have sold if it made it. You know, because it's a big, it's an aggressive play. You know, but that's um, I close out early, and I'm always, you know, the platform's open, ready to close out. And um, 
it just didn't work out guys. So $100 loss on um, IDXG and that's life. And you know, I'm going to broadcast my successes and failures in this learning journey. Uh, but still not trading with real money yet. I'm just still learning. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and enjoy your night. Bye.